All right, project for the moment now is uh, furnace not working. And it's thermostat is dead, which could mean a few different things, but let's see if we can figure it out. This one's got no batteries, so it's fed from the furnace. There's been a little suspect here. Somebody's been, electrician's been in here cutting holes and pulling wires. So let's see if they shorted it out. No air condition in this unit. So between these two, between the red and the white, there should be about 24 volts AC. And we have nothing. Let's go check out the furnace. Alright, so for starters, the switch is off. Let's just flip it on and see what happens. power you can see a status light in there this type of furnace typically runs a 12 code a 1 and a 2 flash for blower startup but I don't see that that's not good so I see this plastic peephole into the burner it's melted and somebody siliconed it if that's melted that more than likely uh, plugged exhaust uh, plugged heat exchanger I'm not sure yet let's see what happens here if we can go upstairs and see if we got voltage or I can check it I can check it right here These are the, the thermostat wires. Just gonna look and see if there's the 24 volts AC. And there it is, 27. So we'll go upstairs and see if they cut that. I want to force I want to force the furnace on so I'm just using the fuse in my meter to jumper this to make sure the furnace actually runs.
So shorting, you know, simulating the thermostat here works just fine. We'll go upstairs and see if we got power up there. Simulate the thermostat. I do have the voltage, so furnace should kick on. And I hear it running. And it shuts off, so I'm going to assume we got a bad thermostat. furnace is running let's see how long it goes apparently this goes blank after a little bit so we might have a intermittent short so what I'm looking for in there is to make sure the flames are going into the burn chamber not rolling out if it, and this is combustible air coming in exhaust going out that's nice and warm so there's foliage that's cold so it's inhaling good so if it doesn't breathe good there's a little switch right here called a rollout switch the fire will roll out of the burner chamber and that's usually when they melt this plastic so I'm a little suspect of that but right now the thermostat is on and it's working, but it's I can't change the temperature on it. So I'm going to guess it's an intermittent problem with the thermostat. So I'm going to go replace that real quick. This is a, a simple system. There's only two wires. There's no air conditioning or anything. We got a little condensation leaks here from this. Probably the trap was plugged. Just go through all that stuff. One time I was here, I was putting a, a bathroom in here, remodeling the wall and stuff. And for no reason, his gas valve was shut off. And then yesterday, the owner said the power was shut off. So somebody's in here messing with stuff. I don't know, sabotage or what, but this is a house that's being flipped. But I'm going to say the furnace is just fine, and we're going to replace the thermostat. Alright, so we've got a few issues going on here. Not sure if I heard a mouse in here. There's a condensation problem. I pulled the filter out, and that is just packed. So before we change that, let's clean this out a little bit. bag
it's all the condensation from combustion it builds up in here and then there's a little little trap here right here that's supposed to drain but we're gonna guess that's plugged because it's running everywhere else all right, let me take that apart and we'll get that clean big problem if that's plugged then this fills up with water and then your combustion air blower your power vent can't spin very good but I don't hear anything in there now so jumper switch for gas or electric this one is gas need a couple batteries set the clock and stuff later. Let me go downstairs and finish up the furnace part. Alright, new furnace is in, or new filters in. Alright, I'm going to go turn the thermostat on. You watch.
another thing I want to watch for when the main blower kicks on. Watch the fire and see if it blows back out or if it turns orange. It should be nice, clean, blue fire. If it does blow back out or it's got it turns a turns orange, then the more than likely have a hole in the heat exchanger, which means the new furnace. So I'm just gonna watch that. That's it. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.